months especially, uh, going around the factory um, and then working on, say, uh, the, the, the paint shop, the body shop where we weld up the body. Elon Musk desires to change the world, but almost inarguably he has done so already, both in past endeavors with the creation of PayPal and more recently with his SpaceX efforts as the CEO of the first private company to send a spacecraft to the International Space Station. But the future, as partially laid out in the Tesla Master Plan Part 2, holds even more promise and, if Musk is successful in his ambition, could see the entrepreneur change aspects of our lives almost beyond recognition. Today's video is all about this. Before we begin with the video, stay tuned and subscribe to our channel for more uploads like this. Here we begin. If anyone can surprise the world with his ambitious projects, it is Elon Musk. The billionaire announced that he is building a new city in Texas to be called Starbase, around the rocket launch site of his company SpaceX. Used to cause a stir by typing just a few words, Musk posted on Twitter that he is creating the city of Starbase, Texas. Later he alluded to his project to colonize the Red Planet, hinting the Starbase would be just the beginning to go further. From there to Mars and hence the stars, detailed the CEO of Tesla. The tycoon, who is currently the second richest person globally, said that his city would occupy an area much larger than Boca Chica, a place that houses a launch site for SpaceX and where the company is building its Starship rocket. Elon Musk shared some characteristics that his new city would have, such as that it will be friendly to dogs. He also hinted that it would be directed by the Doge, which can be interpreted in two ways. On the one hand, it references the Doge's former rulers of Venice and Genoa. But on the other hand, he could also be talking about Dogecoin, the cryptocurrency inspired by the Cheems meme that Musk has long endorsed, which would be more interesting. Eddie Trevino, judge for Cameron County, Texas, confirmed that SpaceX informed the authorities of Elon Musk's intention to incorporate Boca Chica into the city of Starbase. The official noted that the mogul and his company must comply with all state statutes of incorporation and clarified that the county would process any petition following the law. The 49-year-old billionaire is determined to make Texas his main base of operations in addition to its launch center in Boca Chica. SpaceX has a rocket test facility in the town of McGregor and they plan to build a manufacturing plant in Austin. In July 2020, it was announced that Tesla's next gigafactory would be built outside of Austin. Last December, Musk confirmed that he would be moving from California to Texas and at that same time, auctioned all his property in LA to finance his Mars colonization project. The potential of power. In the master plan part dough, it was announced that Tesla would be merging with Solar City. Both Musk companies that have thus far run separately, combining the two intends to bring together Tesla's power storage technology with Solar City's panels, or as he put it in the master plan, create stunning solar roofs with seamlessly integrated battery storage. These solar roofs will not just be a module on the existing roof, but act as the roof itself, and they will inevitably be operating in conjunction with Tesla Powerwall. The home battery designed to charge from solar during the day, then power your home during the evening. Ultimately, the intention seems to be the Tesla Solar City equipped houses to go off grid, achieving a net zero energy rating in which their consumption is only as much as their production. In Musk's words, the point of all this was and remains accelerating the advent of sustainable energy so that we can imagine far into the future and life is still good. That's what sustainable means. It's not some silly hippie thing, it matters for everyone. The importance of continued development of sustainable energy is obvious, and with innovations such as Harvard's bionic leaf, the plausibility of large-scale replacement of fossil fuel dependency is increasing. To take the idea to its furthest conclusion, we must imagine a world in which houses, possibly even entire cities, are powered by sustainable energy alone. At most, the grid would act as a backup generator in case of energy or excess demand. Perhaps the grid will not exist at all, supplanted by greener measures. Means of production. Musk is in the energy game on multiple fronts, but it's how he's applying it at Tesla, which is perhaps most revelatory. But of course, we already knew that Tesla planned to expand its product line and work on autonomous vehicles. Until the latest entry in the master plan, we didn't all know that the product line expansion will see Tesla offering commercial vehicles alongside affordable cars and that the autonomous development has far loftier aims than a base level of self-driving vehicles. To look first at the expansion of Tesla's product range, it has announced the development of both heavy-duty trucks and high-passenger density urban transport. Both wheels, of course, will be electric alongside 
cornering the market on affordable to run municipal vehicles. Tesla is expanding into vehicles aimed at the standard consumer with a new Model 3 starting at $35,000. As a result of the expansion into low-cost vehicles, the next few years may well see the roads filling up with Teslas, all of which will, by one means or another, ultimately be recharged by solar power. Beyond its vehicles, though, Tesla is looking to lead on a broader scale of manufacturing and sooner than may have been expected, beginning work on designing the machine that makes the machine, as they start on factory machines that claim to be first version ready in 2018. Autonomous Automobiles With Tesla leading the way on the vehicle side of affordable electricity enhancing the means of manufacturing, the vision of a nation of Tesla drivers is not so far-fetched, except that is for the fact that Tesla doesn't plan for you to be driving the car. As a leader in the development of autonomous vehicles, Tesla's goal is to put a car on the road with a self-driving capability that is 10 times safer than a human driver. And more than just driving itself, the car will be summonable at the touch of a button and, when not in use, can be added to the shared Tesla fleet to earn you money. The importance of the fleet is multifaceted. Aside from earning you extra cash when your car links to it, your vehicle will, in a sense, be improving itself. The larger the Tesla fleet grows, the more data the company will have to improve between car awareness and other fleet AI tech. Additionally, Musk has asserted that outside of the customer-owned fleet, Tesla will operate its fleet in cities where demand exceeds the availability of customer-owned cars, meaning that there should always be a Tesla available to take you where you want. There you have already been suggestions as to Tesla aiming to compete with Uber using its autonomous vehicles, and the idea certainly seems to fit with the emerging vision of Tesla future. However, it is important to take note that this is still very much a future concern. The recent death of a Tesla test pilot is indicative that there is still plenty of work to be done with the technology. Yet we must also consider that the wide-reaching approach is not a typical business move, but instead an extension of Elon Musk's apparent desire to save the world. It is unfortunate that, as of now, saving the world consists of beta testing potentially dangerous tech with average consumers. While it is easy to be blinded by the potential of autonomous cars, it is important to remember that its failing in arguably simple areas resulted in a man's death. And as pointed out by the Director of Ethics and Emerging Sciences Group, Dr. Patrick Lynn, is an article of IEEE Spectrum. These are failings that the average consumer is likely to be susceptible to. Osmandia's Complex there's something more than a little comic book about Elon Musk. His plans practically scream, I want to save the world. He was the partial basis for Robert Downey Jr.'s portrayal of Iron Man, and he has the money, intellect, and world-spanning plans of a supervillain. There is no doubt that this is a man that wants to change the world, and more importantly, a man who has the capability to. His success, however, could seek control over our energy and driving needs placed largely in the hands of one man. While his aims are certainly impressive and almost indubitably for the good of the world, it's hard to wonder if that kind of concentrated power is a good thing. So that's all. Stay tuned and subscribe to our channel for more videos.